Hey yo, Rudd's here. Today's soap review features Murphy McNeil Black Mountain Shaving Nata Hala. Nata Hala is a collaboration fragrance soap aftershave and EDP uh, collaborated with Murphy and McNeil as well as Black Mountain Shaving from Instagram, also known as Joe Catone. Uh, artwork was by Chicano Designs on this uh, beautiful packaging. This scent will release on October 12th, 2019 at 9 a.m. Central Time. The box set featuring the Soap Splash and EDP will be available at murphymcneil.com and individual pieces will be available for Murphy McNeil Stockists, Magabrazers.com, as well as Top of the Chain if you're in Canada. Portion of the proceeds will go to the Nature Conservatory, uh, excuse me, Nature Conservancy at nature.org. So if you're not able to pick up a set, but you do want to support, I urge you to check out that link, which I will link below and uh, give them a donation. So, Nantahala is named for the Nantahala Forest, uh, which Black Mountain Shaving is familiar with, and I believe visited as a child. The scent is meant to inspire nature and the connections we as humans have with it. Regardless of what walk of life we're from, nature plays a role in connecting us all. This features notes of bright citrus, lavender, melon, rosemary, geranium, rose, pink pepper, aquatics, labdanum, patchouli, suede, wood, amber, and tonka. The resulting fragrance is a earthy masculine accord of both aquatic and woods. <clears throat> Mrs. Rudds loves this scent. She finds it extremely sexy and approves of it for all wares. Scent strength on this is mid out of the container and remains mid for the entire shave. And trythatsoap.com recommends Talbot Shaven Chittangano Creek as a similar scent profile. So this scent is offered in Murphy McNeil's limited Kodiak base. It is named Kodiak because of its inclusion of bear tallow along with beef tallow and duck tallow. This soap is on the firmer side of the firmness spectrum and is an extremely thirsty soap. I will list the ingredients below for you to see what's up with the soap base if you care to do so. When properly dialed in and hydrated, the soap base itself will take on the consistency of Elmer's glue. Very dense, high sheen lather. With a nearly unmatched slickness. Both primary and residual slickness on this soap base are elite. And in that short conversation of slickest soaps I've ever used. Post shave is no slouch either. Elite in class, providing a ultra luxurious feeling of soft, supple, silky skin once you rinse the uh, visible lather away. No need 
for a post shave routine with this soap base if you choose not to. Your skin will still be protected and well hydrated. I've thoroughly enjoyed using this soap base. I had the pleasure of testing quite a few iterations of it. And I can tell you that the uh, Kodiak soap base is an absolute game changer. As such, it receives a shave score of 99. For similar performing soap bases, I suggest you check out Declaration Grooming Milk Steak or Barrister and Man. Needless to say, I'm uh, super impressed with the Murphy and McNeil Black Mountain Shaving Collaboration, not in Hala. Uh, really enjoy this scent and uh, the performance on this Kodiak base is just absolutely out of this world. So do hope you'll have an opportunity to check this out when it releases on October 12th, 2019, 9 a.m. Central Time. Uh, support the guys if you can. If not, check out Nature conservancy and uh drop them a dollar donation if you would as always thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it comment below if you have anything to say and if you're not already a subscriber please become one see ya